In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Bookmarklet to manually add your products to your Linkdelly account. To start, you're going to click on the Bookmarklet tab up at the top and you're going to simply drag it into your bookmark bar. So you'll drag and drop and then it will be in your bookmark bar permanently. And that's the first step you have to do to manually add products to your account. Now Link Deli has a lot of available shops you can work with, but sometimes there are shops that you may want to link supplies to that's not in the Link Deli available shop, and that's what I'm going to show you to do. Go into a list here that I've already created and I click on edit, and here's where we can manually add some products from a shop that's not on the available shops list. So I opened up another browser, the 10 stamps, and I clicked on a stamp. So then I'm going to click on that Link Deli that we dragged to the bookmark, and it automatically fills in everything for you. Now here I can add it to an existing list, which I went ahead and did, and then clicked Add Product, and that's it. It's already, it went right into my list as you can see here. It's also going to be a searchable product now for you because it's something that you manually added to your library. So here I can go in and type the name of the stamp set and click on Search, and it's going to pop up in the search for me from now on. This is where that Mine box is important. When you have that box checked Mine, that's going to pull up any supplies that you've manually added. Let's go ahead and do it one more time, and this time I won't add to a list. I'll click on a stamp set, then I'll click up there on the Link Deli bookmark bar, and then I'll simply add product because all the stuff is auto-filled for you. And now it's been automatically added to your library. You can see I did not specify a list there. So now it's going to show up in my supply list below when I do the search. So I typed in floral border, and there it is. And then you can click and add it to your supply list or whatever. It'll be in your library forever until you manually delete it. <laughs> So that's it. That's how you uh, use the bookmarklet. So I hope you found this video helpful. If you have any questions, send an email or leave a comment below in the video. Thanks for watching.